Did you know that 9.5 million tonnes of food gets wasted in the UK alone each year? I didn't, but I found that out today. And as someone that is a massive contributor to that, here, there and everywhere have teamed up with the Too Good To Go app so that we can show you guys what it's like to try and save some of this food from landfill and hopefully get a good deal while you're at it. So to start the day off, we're picking up a breakfast from Levens Manchester. I've got a Too Good To Go order. Perfect. Breakfast secured. Back to the van now and see what we got in this mystery bag. So to start it off, we've got one, two, three, four, five. A stack of five bagels. That'd probably cost you about a quid from Tesco. Oh, wow. Waffles. And more waffles. And that is it. We've got some chocolate waffles there, so let's give it a bite and see what it's like. Right, the waffles do slap. These are very, very nice. However, I did just pay £3.6 for five waffles and five bagels. And currently, I'm going to eat this one. But then after that, I've got quite a, a fair bit of food to waste there because I don't really know what I'm going to do with the bagels. I might save them for later and see if I can do something with some of the other things I get from some of today's mystery boxes. But not a clue so far. I'm going to finish this and I'll catch you at the next destination. With a questionable first mystery bag in our back pocket, we're off to the second one. I've gone on the Too Good To Go app and found a place called Fruit, which is a frozen yogurt place. So I'm going to head there, pick up one of their mystery bags and let's see what we get. I've got a too good to go order. Perfect, thank you. Have a good day, love. See you later. Second mystery bag secured. So I'm heading back to the van and we'll find out what we've got in there because you're not actually allowed to eat in any of these stores when you pay for it on the too good to go app. So I have to go back to the van and eat there. Luckily, I've got my home everywhere I go. This is what we got. So we've got one and two. So we've got two frozen yogurt pots. Let's open them and see if they're the same. They look the same to me. A purple and yellow fruit, which is a frozen yogurt, I'm guessing. So let's uh, dig in and see what it's like. Oh, the purple side isn't nice. Yeah. yeah, that's not for me, that one. The yellow side's quite good, though. Fruit, frozen yogurt. It's not that good, to be honest with you. I'll uh, pop up on the screen now how much I actually spent on this. I got two of exactly the same yogurts, so I've got two of the same ones here. No toppings or anything like that. But hopefully, this video can pick itself back up and show how good it can be to save the leftovers. But potentially, it might all just be a waste of money. You've got to stay tuned for that one. So, I'm going to finish this because I don't want to let this one go to waste and I'll see if anyone in Manchester wants to take this off me. So I didn't want to waste this frozen yogurt because the premise of the video is to not waste any food today. So I'm going to go and drop this off to a friend of mine that's off work. So I found a way so that the bagels don't go to waste. If I'm not going to eat them, I know something that will. There you go, guys. They're all swarming, they're all on the way. There you go, some for you. I've started something maybe I shouldn't have. <laughs> they're all following me. Right, I've got a too good to go order. Perfect. Well, yeah. Perfect, thank you, pal. Oh, cheers, you're a star. I shall, thank you. Much bigger bag than last time. <laughs> thank you. Take care. I've got a bit more confidence in this bag because this one is rammed. There's a lot of food in here. So a nice big bag of too much food for me to eat on my own. And Snoopy's begging me for it. He's trying to give me paw. He's dying for food, but you've already been fed. You've already had your food. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and catch up with a couple of my mates that have finished work early and treat them to some Greg's. Well, I best show you what we got from Greg's then. This has definitely been the best one of the lot. This cost me about three quid so far. Everything's been roughly about three quid. So we've got two sausage rolls in here. We've got a tuna butter. Another bag full of 
two pasties and a sausage roll. So we've got three sausage rolls, two pasties, a butter, and then we're on to the desserts now. So we've got in here a little chocolate muffin, little kid's muffin, and uh, one last thing, which I believe is a chocolate croissant. Look at that. That is not a bad haul. So uh, who wants what, boys? Sausage roll. There you go, Mosh. Well, I best eat the rest of this. I'm buzzing. This has definitely been the best value for money so far. And the people that commented saying Greg's would be the best, you were, you were right. So I'll pick you back up later when I go to the supermarket to go and get a mystery bag from there. And then I'll be cooking up some food, which I don't know what. So that's going to be quite exciting. Catch you later, guys. We're at Morrison's, the last place we've got to come today. Hopefully, we're going to get a good mystery bag to end the day off and I'll be able to cook some decent food out of it. I'm here to collect a too good to go order. Too good to go yes. order? Yes. Okay, I'll find out about it. No problem. Cheers. You Cheers. Oh. You're not on film, don't worry. <laughs> right, much appreciated. That is a lovely size bag. <laughs> Take care, love. See you later. Have a good shift. So we're back from our trip to Morrison's and this is the big bag we got. So I'm going to go through it and show you what we ended up picking up. First of all, a pack of donuts. Next, I've got a loaf of white sourdough bread. Some more bread, parsnips. We've got half a cucumber. Mixed veg. Most of this is fucking useless. We prosper anyway, we carry on. Ooh, grapes. I love grapes. Oh, a stir fry salad box. So it's not been too much of a waste, but the food, I'm just not gonna be able to make a meal out of it, unfortunately. Luckily, I've got dessert and I've got some grapes to pass the time, but it's not gonna make tea. So I'm gonna have to find something on the app now that I can go and pick up for tea. And hopefully it's a little bit better than what we've had today. Like I said, Greg's has been the only one that was half decent. So I'll pick you back up when I find somewhere to go and get tea. Right, well, after the disaster we had at Morrison's, we've come to Tolbury Carvery. I'm not sure where I go. Over here, I'm guessing. Oh, there's someone else ordering two good to goes. Are they good? Yeah. yeah. Oh, great. I'm looking forward to this. There we go. Let's take them back to the van and eat them. Well, after having a pretty shit experience at Levens this morning, and then the frozen yogurt place not being any good, and then going to Greg's and sort of getting a little pick-me-up because theirs was a half decent value for money, but still, I got let back down by the Morrisons one. It just wasn't enough, and it wasn't stuff I was even going to use. But this, now this is a reason to use the app. Look at that. That is a big, big amount of food. That could feed two of us. Is the too good to go up a scam? Well, personally, I believe it's all down to where you go. So we've had some good experiences in today's video, such as Greg's and Toby Carvery, where we've had exceptional value for money. And then there's been places like Morrison's where I just don't think they've got the gist of it. If they did mystery bags full of purposeful food that you could actually make a meal out of, then I believe that'd be a great alternative to just giving your bags full of things that are going off today and you're not going to be able to use where you're paying for a company's waste so the only way we're going to find out guys if this app is actually worth it is if you hit the link in the description you download the app for yourself and come back to this video and leave some comments of places that you'd suggest to other people some places that you'd avoid and some places that we should check out and hopefully we can all stop landfill and get a good deal while we're at it so i hope you've liked the video guys don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss a single one of my uploads and i'll catch you next monday for another video take care guys donuts and apples any good to you oh yeah please there you go mate oh thank you brother no thank worries you. man right come thank here snoop you. see you later pal have a good one yeah